Along with Mother's Day comes the prospect of warmer days here in Maine. For communities across the state, that means a return to a beloved tradition, the farmer's market. This weekend, some open for the first time this year, offering an important economic boost for farms entering a busy growing season. Our Donovan Lynch has more. It would be hard to pick a better morning to mark the return of a main tradition. It's nice to see old friends catch up, see how their winters have been and stuff. Farmers, food makers and their loyal customers joining together Sunday for the first outdoor Bar Harbor Farmers Market of the year. For many behind the table, it's a welcome opportunity to grow business. Making connections and then developing those relationships is huge. Madison Jones is a recent University of Maine grad and heads Seal Point Farm, which is offering elaborate Mother's Day bouquets. She estimates about 70% of her yearly business comes from markets like these. This covers a lot of the bills, so it's really great to have this opportunity. Across the way, it's a similar feeling of relief for Lauren Mapes of Whitaker Farm in Brooks. For us, it's the cash flow starts back up. We've made it through the winter on the amount of money that we have for, the, <laughs> for that time when we have to purchase everything. As quaint as this all may look, these markets are part of a substantial economy driven by direct farm to customer sales. According to the most recent data from the U.S. Department of Agriculture, in Maine, the total value of these direct food sales reached $342 million in 2020. That's the fifth highest in the country, topped only by much larger states like New York and California. As for why here? There are really dedicated customers to the farmer's markets that um, are well established and have been here for a long time. And with a whole season ahead, that valued business is only just beginning. In Bar Harbor, Donovan Lynch, New Center, Maine.